Welcome to our, our channel. channel. Let's, Let's do, do it together. together. Look at that! Oh, it's so delicious. So delicious. This is two pounds of chicken. And we're gonna prepare that for chicken skewers. So I just cut it like one, uh, one inch. Like cubes. Yeah. Yeah. This is uh, skinless and boneless chicken thigh, uh, two pounds. So I just cut them. It's easier using the scissors because it's not easy to shape them into cubes because you know chick chicken thighs sometimes they are small, they are big. So it's like that. You just cut it. Now we already cut that into cube. We're gonna put our ingredients. We're gonna put smoked paprika. And we're gonna put some black pepper. Then, if you wanna know how many, like for example, a teaspoon, but well, you can check the description box below. Because I will put the exact quantity there. Olive oil. Yeah. This one is the steak spices. I just put in the grinder. I like to have some uh, more taste. Okay. And we're gonna put barbaro. Yeah, chicken bouillon. And last but not least, yeah, salt. Salt. Just be careful with the salt. Okay. I don't. Put it like that because I don't want to make an accident. Okay, and now we're gonna mix it. Mix next. And after that, marinate it for at least uh, six hours to overnight. It's much better. The longer, the better. Yeah. We have to put it in the fridge. Now I'm gonna prepare the basting for uh, the chicken skewers. I will just use a good spoonful of uh, mayonnaise. I like to put that uh, sweet chili sauce for the uh, chicken paprika skewer, uh, skewers that we're gonna cook in the air fryer. This is what you gonna put as a basting once your chicken is already cooked. I just prepared it ahead of time. And just a dash of pepper, yeah, black pepper, and also garlic powder, just to give it a bit of taste. And of course, the paprika, the smoked paprika. Yeah. And you just mix it. That's it. And I will just put just a teaspoon of tomato ketchup. Just for the color, happy color. Yeah. See? Once it looks like this, it's ready. You don't need to put salt. Just up to up to you. Once the chicken is already cooked, you're gonna see if it needs salt or not. Yeah. Because this one is only a basting. It's also gonna serve as a sauce. Mm-hmm. So I'm already putting the skewers, the chicken paprika. We're gonna cook that in air fryer. This is the air fryer stick. That's uh, oh, if you are asking me, it comes with a package when so I bought the air fryer. They give us this also these skewers. So that's how we do. Okay. <laughs> anyway, guys, I'm just using my hand. I run up my plastic gloves and I wash my hand, you know. Just like this, make sure they are um, compact so they will not segregated by each other. And you put it here, just for now. 
now the chicken uh, skewer already uh, prepared we just gonna put it in this rotating skewer prior look you have to put like this and put it there it's secured you captured that darling yeah see so we are gonna put it there and this one is in here oopsie and there so you have to make it make sure yeah they are securely attached oops don't worry about that because it's heavy that's why and the next one is there and uh, see it's look like this when it's done and we're gonna put in our um air fryer so we're gonna put it in so we're gonna put it in just be careful because it's not yet on so I can put my hand in here so my air fryer has something to you can put it there so you have to make sure they are aligned and hold on because it's a lot look at that just focus Ooh, you boring. just press chicken they already preset up if you press chicken they will give you the proper uh, how high the temperature you have to and then how many minutes it's 25 minutes see it's rotating so it's evenly cooked so that's why I like this kind of air fryer so we bought that from Costco this is already done you just need to put iron basting yeah so the problem with this one it doesn't rotate once it's it's already finished so that's why you have to do it by yourself the good thing that's why I told you guys you wait your chicken to cook first before you put your basting or else it's gonna get boring so I have to put also on the other side so I have to take out the rotating basket so um, I already take out from the air fryer and be careful that's why I'm wearing the gloves the silicone gloves and I have to coat it and after that you finish everything cold you put back in the air fryer and cook for five minutes five uh, minutes everybody five minutes for 375 Fahrenheit now it's fully cooked I'll have to just take it out and we're gonna put in our platter so it's look like that I'm just gonna take it out from the basket. Oh, it's hot. Be careful. It just. I like this uh, rotisserie basket because it's really easy to take it out and put it in. You just need to use your silicone gloves or any um, mittens you have. But I like the silicone gloves because you can wash them. Look at that! Oh, it's so delicious! It's so delicious! It's Isabel's favorite, another favorite food. Now we're gonna eat the chicken. We're gonna try it. Cheers! Mmm! So delicious! Mmm! -hmm. Mm. We like it not spicy, but you can make it spicy if you want it. So we're gonna stop talking and we're gonna continue eating. Yummy! Bye! Bye! Thank you for watching! See you in the next video!